Do you know what's stuck in my head? You do know what's stuck in my head, don't you? Everything is awesome. Are you guys ready to see the craziness that is my eyeball? If I look this way, there's nothing. But if I look this way, super red. Doesn't hurt, doesn't feel like anything, not irritated at all. I don't know why it's like that, but uh, it is. All right, we just went to Publix and we're gonna grill out some steaks, but as it looks, we might grill out some steaks in the rain. It's really looking like it's about to pour. But I wanted to get in the pool. I don't know if that's gonna happen. We'll try our hardest to grill in the rain, but getting in the pool, well, we can get in the pool in the rain, but as long as there's not like lightning everywhere. I don't think I'll ever get in the pool in the rain, just cause I'm huh? like, I'm afraid now. I've, I've <laughs> even, I've even ridden my motorcycle in the rain. My motorcycle. Yeah. <laughs> Here comes the contemplation. I want to grill. It's not raining right now, but I feel like it's going to rain soon-ish. But it doesn't really look like it's going to rain because it's it's like dark right here. But then over there, it's not. Like, that's not... Oh, there's some thunder. Well, hmm. All right, I'm doing it. I'm going to fire up the grill and just hope that it, like, holds out long enough. Even though I know that it's raining, like, right there. Oh, what should I do? What should I do? Oh, I'm going to do it. All right, wish me luck. It's, like, getting much worse than it was two seconds ago. This may have been like the worst idea I've ever had, but we're having an idea. Oh yeah, it's starting to rain right now too. There's a dead butterfly in the pool. So let me ask you guys this. You guys think that that's tall enough for me to bring that inside after it gets like, when it's not shooting flames out of it, you know? I don't know. This is going to be the grill versus the thunderstorm is what this is going to be. It's uh, raining pretty hard now. Not like super hard, but it is raining harder. I had to take down the tent that was back there because it started blowing around like crazy and I didn't like that so I didn't want it to shoot into something or blow away or get broken. So I took it down. Come on little charcoal, I believe in you. You can do it. Stay lit. Stay lit long enough for me to just close the lid because that will keep most of the rain out and we'll be good to go then. I like how it's not really raining that hard but like literally I think lightning just struck that house. Well now it's making a lot of noise. Keep going charcoal. You can do it. Uh oh. This isn't good. Don't do that. Arg. You think I should just close it? And we'll see what happens. No, I'm gonna close it. I don't know if that was a good idea or a bad idea. But I hope it was a good idea. I don't really know though. Oh. Yeah. I hope you guys got to see that like out of the corner of the shot. Well that's not good. That's like the charcoal just went out. What is going on? Oh man, it's getting pretty uh, sideways rainy over here. It's, uh, it's a good time. Still trying to grill. Want more lightning? I feel like I'm in Jurassic Park or something. My favorite part was that the, uh, the radar said that we weren't going to get any rain. Yeah, that looks like some rain to me, by the way. Oh, and uh, for those of you guys that are coming here on like a summer trip or a holiday, this happens every day <laughs> at three or four or five. Now, look, see that lizard doesn't even care. He's like running around eating some bugs. All right, I'm thinking I'm going to open this thing back up again and hope for the best. I just looked. It went out. Darn it. Yeah, that may have been too close for me. I should probably go inside now. Bandit, do you like thunderstorms? Yeah, you look so happy. All right, here's the steaks that we got. And here's the dog that's scared. And here's the Jen that's pretty. <laughs> I'm supposed to rub these with oil and three tablespoons of olive oil. Yeah, oops. These feel like maybe they're not gonna be good. I think they're gonna be good. Should you beat on them? I don't know, is that what you do? I don't know how to make meat. I mean, you can tenderize it. It looks all right, it looks pretty tender. Yeah? Yeah, look at is that. Is that what you do? Yeah, massage it. it does so good. <laughs> Do I feed it beer like the Kobe beef? Okay. You're just doing some olive oil, some garlic, and some salt and pepper. Yes. Right? Ooh, yeah. Because who's here? Salt and pepper's here? That's right. <laughs> oh, wow. That was a lot of garlic. Is that not? No, no, it's going to be delicious. I like it. I should have done their directions. No. Okay. It's okay, Bandit. Everything's okay. All right, so the grill is, I think, out of the question right now. But uh, good news is it's not lightning as much as it was. Funny thing is Bandit's super scared. But like if I open the door, he's like, yeah, let's go out there. That looks awesome. But, oh, there's a little bit of lightning. Oh, he ran away. This is like the best day of my life. <laughs> 
fill that pool, Rain. Do your work. I'm just, I wish you hadn't put out my grill. Yes, look, the grill's still going. It's starting to slow down. It's not as like crazy. And oh, by the way, for you guys visiting that are gonna come here on holiday or vacation or whatever, this right here was a total of 10 minutes from when I started filming and we were looking at the grill. When I closed the grill, I said, I'm gonna go close the grill. From that point until now has been 10 minutes. And this, that's what a difference, right? Like it's not so bad, not crazy lightning everywhere, not windy, not anything. How ridiculous is that? Yes, come back to life, grill. You can do it. Look at that, by the way, it's not raining at all anymore. Still thundering a little bit, but uh, yeah, that was it. 15 minutes later. Holy macaroni, I wish I'd shown you guys making this. <laughs> Cause yeah. this is like legit salsa. Well, I think it's more of like a topping because it's it's only quartered the um, tomatoes, so they're a little bit bigger. So it's gonna be delicious either way. It is gonna be delicious. Yeah. Oh, and it started raining again, but that's okay because I got the grill started. We got those steaks cooking. Oh my gosh, look at what we're doing. Look at this, it's looking like a thing. Stuff's happening. This is the best because these are my grilling clothes. Holy macaroni, that's a good looking steak. Yeah. Like perfect. It does, it looks great. Is it cutting so good too? Look at that. It is. It's doing yeah. pretty all right. Ladies and gentlemen, we call this taco fresco. I don't know why, but fresh tacos. What's that, three more tacos? I'll do it. That is some delicious looking aftermath for sure. I know this looks like nothing right now, but we're getting ready to watch Wolf of Wall Street. Let's see what it is. We just finished Wolf of Wall Street. I mean, it was a really long movie. It was like a three hour long movie, so it's 11 o'clock now. That's our entire night devoted to one movie with Jonah Hill and, uh, who is it? Leonardo DiCaprio cursing nonstop, start to finish. Literally, every single word that came out of their mouth was the F word. Mm. I will make this announcement though. So, Wolf of Wall Street, Oscar nominated and everything, all that other good stuff. You know what was a better movie than that? The Lego movie. Way better. Literally, if somebody came up to me and was like, hey, we really want to see a movie. We rented two of them. We rented the Lego movie and Wolf of Wall Street. What should we see? I would say the Lego movie. Because... Well, totally different kinds of movies. Yeah, I know they're two totally different kinds of movies, but still. You're gonna have a better time watching the Lego movie. Plus that, and I feel like Wolf of Wall Street isn't one of those movies that you can like get together with your friends and family and watch. Like, we had Jen's friend Valerie was over and we were watching it and I was like, there's just a bunch of naked girls on the TV right now. This is awkward. And then they said the F word 6,000 more times and then did drugs. That's the entire movie. Now you guys know. Spoiler alert! Ah, it's late night now and I have off tomorrow. We just watched Game of Thrones. A little bit uneventful for us. I mean, a few things did happen, but it wasn't like as exciting as the week before, you know, with the, the Viper and the Mountain. That was exciting. You know, so we're gonna go to bed now, unexcited. But we'll see you guys tomorrow. Now it's time to pay the price.